Jennifer? Oh, oh, Jen, don't be so worried. Your sister's going to be fine. How can I not worry, Mom? She's my sister. You think I don't know that? No. Jordan will be fine. She just probably got lost or something. Lost? Lost? She has lived here longer than I have. It's very unlikely she got lost. Besides, she was with someone named Gloria Sweep. Mom, who is Gloria? Mom, you're not telling me something. What is it? Gloria Sweep is your sister's friend. They were friends since high school. Mom, what does the spyglass mean? Now, you won't believe this. You will understand this. Your sister would carry those with her everywhere to see and study the unknown world of Kepcor. Core? What the heck are you talking about? I knew you wouldn't understand. Forget I said anything, really, hon. It doesn't matter anymore. What do you mean it doesn't matter anymore? That sounds important. What is Kepcor? Where is it? What does it have to do with my sister? Your sister was different from most girls. She saw things different. She did things different. She knew things others didn't know. But what does the spyglass do? It's not special. It's the same as any ordinary spyglass. It wasn't ordinary before. What? I better go put lunch on. What? Mom? She never listens! Jordan, where are you? Mom? Dad? It doesn't even look like I'm at home. Uh, oh. Take her with us. Yes, of course. Your Majesty! I told you, Puck. Just call me Oka. I'm sorry, but something happened. What happened? It's Wanook. He's been blinded. So sorry, Wanook. I let this happen to you. I wasn't there. Oh, okay. It, it's fine. It wasn't your fault. I'll be okay. No, I am not as great as a leader as my father and mother were. No, Oka. Don't blame yourself. I should have been looking after my troops. You wish, Furball. They are my troops, including you. Well, you weren't there when they needed you. That's because I had to do something with the Queen. Guys, concentrate on the task at hand. Forgive me, Your Majesty. Uh, I'm gonna feel that in the morning. What a dream. Well, that was definitely not a dream. What were you doing on the edge of your own territory? You could have been killed. Oh, 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 girl. Territory? 
Where am I? You are in the land of the Greenwood clan. As well as you, as we all know, in the great hills and lands of Kepcor. Kepcor? Uh, yes. And I am the new ruler of the Greenwood Kingdom, which we are in deep trouble. My mother told me my sister used to study this, um, land world thing. You do look familiar. <sighs> Her name was Jordan. Blonde fur, blue eyes, and she is a short hair like me. I think I remember a cat come to our land. She helped us with our struggle for food. But that was a long time ago. When? What year? How many years ago? Um, I don't know. Six or five, maybe? Struggle for food? What did she help you? How? You see, we were on the edge. We had no food. We weren't doing well. Our kingdom was on the edge of starvation. We had very, very little food. We lost some people. Oh, I'm so sorry. We thought by killing the plants, because plants, they are everything to us. We, they're like our family. She told us that we could use some plants to grow crops for us instead of stealing other food from other clans. Well, yeah, my sister's pretty smart, and was that a problem that you killed plants? Well, we didn't really kill them, but we thought it was wrong to take the belongings of the plants, so she showed us a new way, and here we are today. And you said you were in trouble. How? We are at war. The Tuscarora. They care not for plants. They do not crop them. They do not breed them, for they destroy them. They kill them with no mercy. They don't use them like us. We use them for our own sake and our clothing for warmth. Them. They use them as slaves. What do you mean by use them as slaves? I'm not sure if you're familiar with this, but here our plants are magical. As you know, maybe in your world, they you have plants, maybe, but I don't. I'm not sure about that. But these plants, they can talk to us. They're they actually can move. They they're like human beings. Awesome. Well, yes, I suppose. Wait a minute. Are you expecting me to help you with this war? If you are up for the task, yes, please. Have you tried reasoning with them? Of course not. They are Tuscaroras. They do not care to reason, but they only want to do is kill. You don't know that. They're like you. They have families. Have you tried? Please tell me you have. That was not a suggestion, for they started the war. And boy, are they looking for a fight. Listen, maybe I can help. I can help you try reason with them. And you guys can live in peace together. Maybe they're just having a problem with plants. Maybe they really need help. For well, I agree with this decision. I don't. It is not your decision, Pa. It's not that bad of an idea. I think we can try. Where are the rest of the troop back at camp? They're trying to gather more food. Well, we must go in the meeting room. Come. try reasoning with them. It wouldn't be bad to create peace. Why should we though? They've killed so many of our men. They shouldn't be trusted. I gotta admit, he does have a point about that. But we can all put this to an end if we have peace with them. 
and then they will leave us alone and we will be one together. But it's all up to Oka, right? You know she is under a loss responsibility. Well, I'm sorry. I, I didn't know that. Well, she is a queen. I thought she was used to these things. Her mother and father just died a month ago. Oh. I'm so sorry, Oka. I, I didn't know. Oh no, it's fine. You didn't know. It's not your fault. I've made a decision. We will meet with the leader of Tuscurora next sunset tomorrow. Does everyone agree? As you wish. Sure. Not up to me. Fine. We must go back to camp. You know, you folk always helped us when you came by. When you find your sister, tell her we thank her very much. I will. Come on. Remore, I can see you agreed to the meeting, finally. Some things are just that important, my queen. I have came up with a theory for our differences. Oh, and what is that? To put in peace for our two races. <laughs> my queen, you suggest we make peace? <sighs> oh, Oka. I knew you were stupid, but I didn't think you were less stupid. The Tuscarora clan will never join you for any reason, for any crime. We do our own things. It's really sad to do this, but I don't agree with you. I don't care what I do to you, and I don't care how much you suffer. What are you saying, Lamore? Goodbye. No! <laughs> Selfish Nor. She doesn't understand, does she? Well, simple being. Us Tuscororas are made out of death and dead plants. With just a touch of our death to life, we kill plants. My queen. I knew this was a bad idea! You brought this among yourself. Good luck. I do not care for your struggle for your new leader. So what happened? Is she... she... dead? This is all your fault. We should have never listened to you. You brang. This danger here, you made it even worse. We lost our leader because of you. I, I didn't know this was happening. I'm so, I'm so sorry. Puck, this is not her fault. She's not the one who killed her. Pretty much is. Taking this nonsense. Listen, I. She's gone. What? She just left? She just left us here? Just. I knew she shouldn't have been trusted. She killed a leader. Only chance for survival is gone. Jennifer. Her name is Jennifer. How do you know that? She didn't even state her name. Her name isn't Jennifer. It's probably like... Jenica or something. Jordan mentioned that she had a sister named Jennifer. 
that's Jennifer. This time, her sister came and she failed us. Well, there's no doubt about that, duh. We have to report this back to camp. I forgive you.